Kevin ran down to a little French bakery and got me a latte and a croissant and a Madeleine. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. This is bad news, guys. This croissant is so good. It's so close to our house. And I'm gonna eat them every day. Kevin said he gained the most weight in Spain when he was living there when he had a little uh, pastry shop near his house. It's true. <laughs> when I was living right next to Ogie Berry, I got really fat. He, he was a little stick figure when he first moved to Spain. But I also lived across the street from a cream vendor. A cream vendor? Yeah, so <laughs> I was getting like not even whole milk, just like cream. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, guys. Finally got my bike back in the city. And it just struck me that Tour de France is about to start. I always use this as my mouse pad. So uh, I think it's uh, time for me to hit the hills again at this zero elevation and see how pro I am from training in the uh, California Alps, basically. Should be great. No, but seriously, uh, I really want to start riding bikes again. It's just such a nice, fun thing to do, and it's a great way to see things, so. Stuck in a classic little city traffic jam. But, you know, at least you get some uh, interesting views, see some interesting people. Commuter life. Who's going running? Rude. Why? I have a complete matching outfit on. We have matching outfits? I do. What do you mean? This is a Nike sweat thing, and that's the New Balance shoes, and they match completely. Huh. What about me? I'm all Nike'd out. Sponsored by Nike. It is a chilly, foggy day today. My coworkers told me that that little taste of summer that we got is officially done for the season. I feel like that was the end of it. Really? I feel like it's gonna be cold from now on. So, you have soup on a cold day. Some veggie minestrone. This is the first time I've gotten minestrone. Yeah, is it good? I love it. And uh, this flower has lasted a long time that his friends died. I think it's time for some new fresh flowers. Day two. Croissant and coffee. Call me the croissant king from now on. Day two. Croissant and coffee. Call All right guys, I am home right now and I'm going to be making dinner for Dota tonight. Well, I say making, but it's gonna be really easy. Um, we both had like a really big lunch. So I was asking her what she wanted for dinner and we were both like something light. And I was thinking, time to celebrate that we live in this beautiful Mediterranean climate. So I got a lot of produce that was all grown here. And one moment, please. All right, this is what's gonna be for dinner tonight. I got three artichokes, two kiwis, two apricots, a plum, these nice little mini bananas 
and a little loaf of garlic bread. I'm really happy, I'm excited. This is gonna be some good California cuisine right here. Who's got a sweet tooth? Me. What do you want? Berry pie. <laughs> what's your alternative if they don't have berry pie? <laughs> and then what's your third? Fruit tart. Fruit tart. Come on, I know you better than you know yourself. You. What'd you think about my uh, Michelin star dinner tonight? It was really good. Oh, you didn't even film it. You didn't film it. Okay, got, like, I filmed the ingredients. Oh, you did? Yeah. He plated but, it very nicely. The assortment of fruits. What was your kiwi favorite? Kiwi was so good. Maybe you should get some kiwis. Get some more kiwis? For tomorrow. Okay. Mwah. Mwah. Guys, Tour de France starts in two days. Also, the Euro Cup is ending soon. Two great sporting events. The Olympics are this summer. Everything's happening so fast. I love it. And the Niners are about to start. Giants are doing great. Don, anything for you? Nope. <laughs>